Hey, Summit County, you're watching Summit Sunrise here on TV8 Summit. I'm Ashley, and I'm hanging out with Morgan from Copper Mountain. How are you today? Great. How are you? I'm excellent, thank you. Good. I love Copper Mountain. Um, <laughs> it's March right now. It's spring break. I bet you guys have a ton going on over there. Yeah, we really do. Uh, March and April are typically really snowy months for us, so fingers are crossed doing our snow dances, <laughs> and we have a ton of stuff going on, so it's going to be a, a really great end to the season. Awesome. And even though we haven't gotten a lot of snow recently, I feel like conditions are fun no matter what when it's sunny out and you can hang out. Um, I know um, my favorite spot is that little uh, deck lodge where you can just hang out and have yes. drinks. Yeah. The sun is just as fun as the snow, I think. Right. Exactly. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about Dos Equis Opera that you have coming up, speaking of yeah. hanging out outside. So those are a new event this season, and they actually take place every Saturday for the remainder of the season. Okay. Um, and it's, a, it's an opera happy hour event. What's better than that? Um, so those typically take place at Storm King Lounge, which is right in Center Village. And there's drink specials, there's live entertainment, there's a free raffle, they do giveaways. So wow. tons of stuff going on. Um, those, again, are 3.30 to 6 every Saturday. Um, but the special thing about tomorrow's event is there will actually be free live music in Burning Stones Plaza, so an outdoor concert as well. Perfect. What type of music? Um, you know, a little bit of everything. The bands are going to change. Um, cool. Yeah. So kind of just a free concert series. This isn't something yeah. that people have to pay for. Not at all. Cool. So just walk down after your day on the yeah. slopes and you enjoy know, some Just live stop music. by and check it out. Perfect. <laughs> um, and you have Subaru Winterfest. As yes. Well coming up. Tell so me about that. that'll be next weekend, the 19th and 20th, and that is our second Subaru Winterfest of the season, and it's really just a big celebration of winter. Um, they have a ton of fun stuff going on. Again, right in Burning Stones Plaza, so in between runs, you can kind of just stop by and check it out. Um, they'll have a scavenger hunt. They have giveaways. They have equipment demos. Um, they have hot chocolate. And this time around, they're actually going to include a little mini freestyle course built by our friends over at Woodward. So that'll be a lot of fun, too. Cool. Is yeah. that for the kiddos then? Do yeah. I mean, so anyone is welcome to go through it. <laughs> kind of kid-sized features, but hey. <laughs> but hey, sometimes if you're like me, you don't <laughs> often ski in terrain parks. You need the kid-sized features there to you start go. out on. <laughs> Perfect. And it's always a ton of fun to stop by those things. Um, you know, for our viewers who uh, maybe this is their first time in Summit County, mm -hmm. there's always tons of swag that you oh, can yeah. get at, at Winterfest and, and giveaways, and it's just always a fun thing to check out. Yeah, and especially um, Subaru Winterfest does give some extra love to all of our Subaru drivers, so make sure to bring your keys. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Good tip. And tell me about your Moonlight Dinners. I know that's something that you do, and uh, your last one is coming up? It is. Um, so that's another new thing for us this season. We did, uh, we're going to do three total, and this third one on March 19th is our very last one of the season. So last chance to check out these really great events. Um, so March 19th, you can actually take the chairlift up to Solitude Station, which is our dining location mid-mountain. Um, you enjoy a fine dining experience that our chef has hand created the menu. Um, there's live music, there'll be, you know, alcoholic beverages, and then you actually get to ski down a groomed run under the moonlight. So it's really a once in a lifetime opportuni opportunity. <laughs> it's perfect. Um, and it really is fun to take the chairlift up at night. I've done mm -hmm. a moonlight dinner before. and. Um, and it's a lot of fun because you just go up the lift. No one else is on the mountain except yeah. the people attending the dinner. And it's right. just sort of a special a special place to like eat and drink and have right. fun on the mountain. It's one of those that combines, you know, a really cool outdoor activity with, with great dining, which is always fun. Um, and it, it is it, just an amazing experience to be out. They try to plan them as close to the full moon as possible, so the moon is out, it's bright, it's it's really a, a really unique experience. Cool. Where can people go if they want to get tickets or just learn more about Copper Mountain and everything that's going on in yeah. March? Yeah. Um, always head to coppercolorado.com. So okay. you'll find our event calendar. Um, you can buy tickets to any of the events, like the Moonlight Dinner. Um, and then you'll always get the best deal on lift tickets and lodging as well. Awesome. Morgan, thank you so much for hanging out today. Of course. Thanks for having me. Folks, definitely check out coppercolorado.com and get your tickets to that Moonlight Dinner. It sounds like a ton of fun. Stay tuned for more Summit Sunrise. We'll be right back.